Hi everyone, this is Terry. Today is June 11, 2012. Uh, I'm actually doing a report on my chest spider. I got it from Underworks and the style number is 988. I got a large. Um, and believe me, you want to get uh, the size for your chest size. Don't go a, a, a size or two smaller because uh, I tried to get a medium <clears throat> because I'm right on the borderline of medium and large. So I thought, wow. I got median and believe me I couldn't couldn't in the life of me to get it out. So I actually had to return to get a large one. And even with a large it was still very hard to uh, get on, you know, like the first try. You know, it was quite a struggle, but finally I um found a way to do it pretty um easy. And the way is to uh you know, poke your head and then stick an arm from one of the armpits first. And then with the free hand, try to flatten out this side, whatever side you try, you poke your hand out first. You try to flatten out that part, and then hold with that hand, and then try to quickly stick the other hand out. So in that way, you only have one side of the uh, chest minder rolled up that you need to straighten out because this side will be pretty flat already, and and it will act as a support for the other one to to be rolled flat. So anyway, if you try, you know what I'm talking about. Um, okay, so I just want to show you guys, this is 988, and I got a large size. And um, as you can see, it actually, I think it works quite well. Um, yeah, I have my stomach here. I, you know, the 988 actually is like, you know, it cuts right here. So, which is good because um, I don't want my tummy to get suffocated. I think the chest alone is good enough. So um, anyway, so this is how it looks. Uh, and on the, to the, on the side, it's a pretty flat. I mean, yeah, I mean, you probably, if you really want to be really, you know, look really, you scrutinize it, it'll be, you see a little bit. But for me, you know, this is good enough. It's pretty good, you know, and so, um, yeah. And then, um, if I if I put any shirt on anything like that, it's totally flat. Let me show you. So anyway, so um, um, yeah. So if I put a shirt on, um, you know, and uh, sorry, I have to have my face cut off because I don't have those. You know, it's from my laptop. So so anyway, see, totally flat, right? I mean. Pretty much, yeah, it's pretty cool. You know, I mean, even if you want to be really scrutinizing about it, you know, even if like just a little bit, if it shows a little bit, it could just be considered as man boot. I mean, because I'm pretty, you know, pretty large a person. So, um, yeah, so anyway, with this, it's totally flat. But, you know, even if I say I got like not a shirt, which is kind of loose, if I got another like t-shirt on top of this you know which is it will be totally fine I mean it's really flat you know um you know still that's pretty flat I mean that's just like if you really look at this part it could just be man boot or something like that but like I said I'm not going to get size smaller because I don't think it will work any further um you know in terms of really pressing this is fine with me plus um like I said, the median couldn't get it out. So um, anyway, so um, sorry about the light because I need to switch around the room to try to find a place where I can show you, you know, the whole body and um, you know, with the light uh, sufficient enough to show. But anyway, so okay, underworks style number nine eight eight. Um, I can take this off so you guys can see. That's fine with me. So um, yeah, it's like those um. Like you call those white beater, whatever those thing, a shirt, whatever, um, tank top. Yeah, so it's how it looks like. And then, <clears throat> as you can see, because I have pretty big boots, so it kind of the fact I squeeze out, you know, see on the side. But other than that, I'm not complaining. And my tummy, and uh, this is what the side looks like. It's I still consider it pretty, it pretty flat now, just a little bit because well. Pretty big, you know, fatty boots here, but um, 
yeah. So um, yeah. So and I got a scar here. Don't mind that. But um, but it binds pretty well. So and like I said um, um, yeah. If if you couldn't put yours on, try the way I I just told you. Um, I try put those things on like from the bottom too. People suggest that if you couldn't get it on, like you could just like um. You know, try to wear it like, like, like wear like a skirt. You know, like try to pull it up from the bottom up. Didn't quite work well with me because, as you guys can see, like, you know, I'm kind of big person and my belly, my yummy, my tummy and uh, my um my butt is not as small as you. So, you know, I mean, I can put it on, but it just it's still it's it's just work. A lot of work. So um yeah, try to want try the way I just told you guys that, you know, try to make sure it's totally pretty flat. You put your head, and then um you know try to pull it down, and then try to grab the side, try to make it flat grab, and then stick this arm out first, and then with this arm stick out, try to flatten out and try to hold the flat part, and and this arm just kind of, and then you know before you actually do this you can actually try to make sure that everything kind of flies a little bit and then you want to hold on this end and then have this arm stick out and then yeah and when you stick this out this part will be kind of rolled up but at least this part will be like you know flat enough so you only have one side you need to deal with believe me because you don't do that because if the whole thing totally rolls up like into a little tight rolls um the entire you know your 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 chest area believe me there's no way you can put it down i mean those things are so tight but at least it's one side it's more manageable so anyway so that's my tip so you can go try okay so um yeah so the sign i ate and uh, i think it's pretty good so i'm gonna stay put with it okay so that's my report thanks bye where's this cursor